Hey guys, welcome to Tony's How To's. In this video, I will show you how to add admin to Roblox game. So adding admin to Roblox game can be really helpful for you to actually manage a few things as well as give VIP treatment to some users. So to get us started, the first thing you want to do is you want to go ahead and open up Roblox Studio and we want to create a new game from scratch. So let's just create a new experience here so that you'll be able to see what I am currently talking about so here let's just create a flat terrain here and from here what we need to do first is we want to open up our toolbox so by default when you create a uh, game here or experience it's all the toolbox will be readily available to you but if this is not available like for example it's not viewable in here in your experience and you want to click on home and toolbox will be available to you but it is actually also available in view mode here and you should see toolbox as well now here what you need to do is we want to add an asset which is HD admin. So let's just tap in HD admin and from here you should be able to see the HD admin here. Now what you need to do is you want to actually add it here on your workspace or in your experience and just click on OK whenever this pops up. Now it's going to actually add HD admin at the Cellware Explorer here. Now you are now actually kind of ready but we need to change a few things here so first thing is we want to save this in roblox studio so let's go ahead and go to the top left that's the file section and you want to save save to roblox and for this example we want to actually create this create a new game now here instead of entire game let's say let's say sample hd admin and from here, you could just leave this as is. It doesn't actually really matter. But if you want to add team create, you could also do that as well. But from here, just click on save and we'll be able to save this on Roblox. Now, once you've saved this one, we're going to change a few of the game settings that we have on our game because a connection or a type of connection will be required for us to actually uh, use HD admin. Now here, let's go to home. And under home, you want to go to game settings. Now under game settings, you want to go to security and you want to enable allow HTTP requests as well as enable studio access to API services. Now from here, just click on save. And again, you want to go to file and just click on publish to Roblox. Now, once you've done that, the next thing that you want to do is basically just start playing the game. So let's just click on play. And from here, it's going to load our experience. And when we when it actually finishes loading, you'll see a pop up appearing on your game. So as you can see, there's now an HD at the top left of our screen, as well as a notification that you rank your rank is owner. Click to view the commands. So if you click on that, you'll be able to see different commands that you could use. So as you can see, there's different ranks for specific users as well as commands that will only be usable by a specific rank. Now, if you if you close this specific window and you want to actually access the HD commands as well, you want to go to the top left, that's where the HD button is, just click on that and you'll be able to see the commands by default. So when we go back one window, you'll see different sections, the about, command, special, admin, and settings. So there's actually a lot to explore here, like for example, the commands here. Uh, the specials as well and the settings in here so if you want to change your team you could change that and a lot of other stuff here like for example for example the notice sound id you could customize your notice sound id if you want the notice volume notice pitch and air volume air sound id and a lot of other stuff here so let's just go back now here we have the admin section so the admin section this is where the people or the people that has a specific our rank will appear but as you can see right now it's not letting us actually to add the specific people into our admin or in our rankings here because we have to edit a specific code for us to add people here so there's just a few tweaks but it's actually really easy so for us to add admins here let's just go back and stop playing this game now in here in our explorer there's going to be a script that we want to edit so let's just open up the hd command section here 
So it's going to be under workspace and under HD admin folder. And you want to actually edit these settings here. So just double click on that and you'll see the different or the details for rankings. So as you can see with owner is automatic set to the owner and has full access to commands and features. Head admin, admin mod, VIP. So they have a different uh, roles and different capabilities as you can see with mod and vp can only use commands on one person at a time can only use commands on their self so as you can see you could just basically change things here so what we need to do is what we need to add a specific user on this section on ranks so as you can see there's a uh, uh, brackets all over it so what we need to do is we want to actually edit this specific bracket here so in here at the first section, where's the double quotation marks, this is where we add the specific name of that specific user in order for them to be part of the head admin or admin section here, or even mod or VIP. It doesn't really matter. You just need to add them here, the name itself. But as you can see at the right side, you see a zero there. So what's that for? So if you really want to ensure that you're currently adding that specific person into that in, in your specific ranking here, then we want to actually add their ID. Now for you to view their ID, you want to go to their profile and you'll see this specific ID or numbers that you see here just before the profile. So what you need to do is you want to copy this specific ID here. And let's go back here on Roblox Studio and we want to paste it here next to the number. Now when we t paste this into the section here and click uh, click on save or just click on control save on your keyboard and uh, uh, close this one is we want to start playing this one. I'll be showing you what's going to look like. So let's just wait for this to load up and let for HD admin load up in our game. So once it loads up, let's just quickly click on HD here and we want to go to admin. And as you can see, I was able to add that specific user. As you can see, the profile picture is the same thing as you can see. Yeah, you can just add them here. And as you can see, you, they've added and once they log in into the game, they will be able to have that access. And that's about it. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, you can use the link in the description to subscribe. See you in the next video.